Nope, nothing at all. Let's get some stankiness going on here. Stanky, go get him. Yeah, go get him, Stanky. I do too. Don't get me wrong, I love Morrowind as well, but I think it's way too uh, RPG and RNG based. Um, a little bit complicated for me, and Skyrim I think is kind of dumbed down a bit. I think Oblor uh, Oblorvian. Oblivion kind of meets that perfect threshold between complexity and accessibility. Oh wow, there is a lot of vampires in this section. Uh, go to my Fated Wrath. Kill my Fated Wrath. This is a very strong vampire. Stanky, I'm giving you another shot at life. And, uh, yeah, Frost Atronach, why not? There we go, look at Frosty. I agree, too. If you have to do a whole bunch of mods to fix what uh, should have already been part of the game, then something's wrong. Ah, oh, no, I don't... I'm very... I'm not offended at all. It takes a lot to get me going. Uh, so I'm pretty laid back. You're probably not going to offend me in the slightest. But anyway, basically what I was saying, we're doing a mage only run. I have never done something like that before in my life. So to kind of give you an idea, I've played through uh, Morrowind, Oblivion, and Skyrim. And I've never done anything outside of being an archer or a fighter with some restoration magic on the side. I've always played it like that. Excuse me. <coughs> so this is the first time I've ever done a mage only run. I'm kind of doing it as like a challenge to myself. And I'm using Obscuro's Oblivion Overhaul, uh, a, a, a full on mod that removes the scaling aspect of Oblivion and provides static enemies that do not level up with you and makes the game a lot harder in many ways and see if I can actually complete the game that way. Oh, okay. I was like, what is going on? Okay, you are... Oh my goodness. There we go. All the blood... The Blood Crest vampires are dead. Ah. I hate lock picking. Have you played the uh, old classic old classics, oldies but goodies? Um, Arena and Daggerfall? I haven't played Arena, but I have played a little bit of Daggerfall not too long ago. It's uh, a unique game, <laughs> I can tell you that. It is an Elder Scrolls game, through and through, but it's, uh, I wouldn't say it's one of my favorites. I'll tell you that right now. Let's go discover this Oblivion Gate, even if I'm not going to actually do it. There's an alternate form of Bessie up here. Alright, found it. Got it. How long have I been streaming? Uh, do you mean tonight? Or do you mean like just total streaming Oblivion overall? Oh my goodness. Yeah, you go get the other evil Bessies. You started a stream, Steam download and your streaming has turned to crap. I'm sorry. <laughs> awesome. Daggerfall and Bloth Arena. Uh, what, do you, what do you say about those games in comparison to the uh, three relative new ones? The ones that really brought Elder Scrolls into the, the gaming, I guess you could say, conscious. Conscience. Conscious. Whatever.
Well, I hope you'll stick around, Lincoln S. Uh, I do plan on streaming a lot of other things. Uh, Oblivion is just the first one. Um, yeah, it's still kind of red. It, like, it never goes away once I've discovered a Oblivion gate. You like the retro stuff better? I do, too. I really do. I mean, don't get me wrong, this game isn't exactly retro, per se. <laughs> but I still find it has a nice old charm to it. Hey, oh, yeah. it's the town crazy. Um, where am I going? Oh my goodness, I'm totally going in the wrong area. Hold on. No! Don't care about offending me, you know? It It takes a lot to offend me, and I, don't, I haven't heard a single word you said that's actually offensive. I mean, it's your opinion, you're entitled to it, and, you know, that's cool. I really don't... I really don't mind. Um, by all means, voice your opinions. This this is all an open forum here. Uh, but I do like to do a lot of uh, other retro games, and I like to do challenges. That's my name, Retro Challenge Gamer. Like, for example, Mega Man games. I do a Buster-only no-death run. I'm not a perfect runner by any means, so I can't do the no-damage stuff. I'm just a casual gamer, just trying to do challenges for fun. But for the Mega Man series, I'm doing Buster-only no-death runs. I just completed a low percentage run of Super Metroid. I've never done that before in my life. I've usually gone up to 90 to 100 percent completion on Super Metroid. So doing a low level or low percentage run was kind of a new thing for me. So yes, and I just beat Mega Man 2. If you want to see what how I did, you can check my YouTube channel, uh, Retro Challenge Gamer, on YouTube, and I have a play series just for Mega Man 2 for you, so you can see how much I did. Hey, thanks for pipping me out, Chris L. Father. Good to see you. you know what? I think it's about time I did this, okay? I'm pausing right now. How the heck do I mod you? How do I mod you? Because you have been sticking with me through thick and thin, and you've been, like, literally one of my... What's, what's the term? Uh, strongest supporters and followers. You have got to be modded. <laughs> and I don't even know how to do it um, in, in Twitch. Once I find out how to do it, you're going to become a mod of my chat, Chris O'Father. I think you got what it takes. You have completed your tasks for the Count, have you not? Then, please, wait here while I inform him. Oh, gosh, i got to wait again. And then he's going to do his little surprise poop, I'm here. Did I just say poop? <laughs> surprise poop, I'm here. <laughs> I take a dump, now I'm here. <laughs> the soundtrack is awesome. I totally agree with you. As much as I love Mega Man 2... <laughs> I don't know what you mean by that's how. I don't, was there a message I missed? There must have been a text message I missed there. But, uh, what was I going to say? As much as I love Mega Man 2 and some of the other Mega Man games, Mega Man 3, which I'll be doing next... Uh, I've only done one and two with Buster only no runs. I've been kind of doing a lot of Mega Man fan games, more so than the official games. I better fix that. <laughs> but uh, Mega Man 3 holds a special place in my heart because it was the very first Mega Man game I've ever played in my entire life. And uh, we had just moved back from Germany to the United States. My dad was in the military. And he bought me a Super Nintendo, and one of the games for the Super Nintendo was the Mega Man 3. And so that's how I got introduced to the Blue Bomber. Got it. Okay, let's see here. Let's see here. Uh, t -t 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 -t. Hey, there you go. You are now a mod of my of my chat. Congratulations, Chris O'Father, and thank you, Link Ness, for providing that. I learn something new every day. I seriously do. What are you doing? Are you going to notify him? Have you notified the count him? Is on his way. Thank you. Where is he going to appear? Is he going to surprise me? What if I wait in a corner? He can't surprise me if I'm in a corner, right? Becoming a mod would only go to my head. I'd become a rational power hungry. 
Well, I guess it's your turn to become power hungry now, because you've been modded. <laughs> He's not going to show up until I show... Oh, there he is, because I was like... I thought he wasn't going to show up until I got into the middle of the room so he can scare me again, you know? So the work is complete. Now we can discuss the information I have for you. Information. Your guild does not fully appreciate the danger which quickly approaches. Hopefully when you return to them, their eyes will be opened. The necromancers are a sign of things to come. An old acquaintance of the guild has come to Cyrodiil, and they are answering his call. Uh-oh. While I do not know for quite what purpose he has arrived, I believe the Guild of Mages is in great Manamarco. Manamarco has returned. He is going to be a tough customer. He's invincible. He's established himself somewhere in the north of Cyrodiil. This is all that I know. See to it that your leader... Traven learns this as soon as possible. I have no love for your guild, but I have no wish to see it destroyed either. Mm -hmm. Mutual mutual complacency, got it. He is an old and powerful necromancer. Traven will recognize the name even if you do not. I have told you all Oops, that I know. sorry, I didn't mean to... Mana Marco has come to Cyrodiil, and I believe he means harm to your guild. Traven Onward. must know this. <laughs> Even I know that some from your guild have defected to join Yeah, like Falcar. You try to kill me by drowning me way back when. You have been attacked once already. It's an oblivion beam. Perhaps it is a mistake to make that assumption. <clears throat> Only time will tell, I suppose. I don't get the meme. Maybe I've not been uh, up on Return my oblivion guild. memes. Prepare yourself accordingly. <laughs> But yeah, Chris, arrow, oh, I've heard of Arrow to the Knee. That one I've heard about. I will tell you that. Man, I am actually hovering around Bruma quite a lot recently. Hi. Do you know a lot about Oblivion? Because it seems like you do. You, you keep saying, I love this game, so maybe you know a lot. Uh, right now, I'm looking for a Daedric artifact to give to Martin that has to be getting rid of, has to be destroyed. I just got the Ring of Namira. It's awesome. I don't want to lose it. So, that one I'm not giving up. I want to get the skeleton key, but I can't get it because I'm weak. Those trolls are going to kill me. And I want to get Azura's star, Hello. but I can't because... It's well, my I, pleasure. I can, but I don't want to get rid of it because I want a, a, a limitless soul gem. So is there any other Daedric artifacts that I can do other those than those three that I don't care about as a mage that I can just give away for Martin to destroy? <laughs> That's funny. You too. Yeah. <laughs> Khajiit, High Elf, and Argonomist. Do you mean Argonian or do you mean an Argonomist? Is that a new, a new race that I don't know about? <laughs> This proves they can't be trusted. No, really. <laughs> Good that we have a healer in town. So what can banal conversation here? This is years, this is epic conversation like right now. Himself. It's almost as if he grew up in Skyrim. I don't think the Oh, Volinaro, <sighs> what are you doing? I need you right now. I need your spells. I do like anime. I do not like Dragon Ball Z. Don't hurt me. To speak but I don't like Dragon Ball Z. I'm just not interested in it. Always um, keep your magical equipment charged. Oh sure, why not? But uh, I've watched quite a lot of anime in the recent right now. Right now I'm watching Trigun with Vash the Stampede. That's kind of funny. I'm enjoying it muchly. Oh. 
Only quality goods for sale here. Bounce what can sword, I interest don't you care. in? There we go. That's the spell I wanted. Tell your Summon Dramor Full Metal Alchemist. I have not gone into that one. I do have it uh, in my collection. I just haven't got around to watching it yet. I do plan on doing that. Um, I just don't know when I'm going to get the time to watch. <laughs> As I said, I can only stream once a week. Thursdays is currently right now the, the day of the week that I stream. So finding time to actually watch a huge series of thousands of minutes of anime is kind of rough. <laughs> what am I doing? Okay. I do want to do Frostfire Glade. Becoming a boy. Oh, come on, Chris. Resist. Resist the urge. I know you can do it. Tears of the Savior. There we go. Oh, for a second, I thought you, um,. Thought you're doing kind of like a weird version of Fusaro Da <laughs> from uh, Skyrim. When someone annoys you and you don't want to talk to them, you just like, you know, just yell in their general direction, Fusaro Da! And then, you know, shoot your hands out and everything and hope that they blow away. <laughs> and they'll look at you funny and hopefully walk away and it works! I should keep doing this. To people I don't want to talk to. Oh, this is going to be fun getting up there. I see my goal. Oh, come on. Let me get up there. Scale of mountains. Oh no. Something's after me. I don't know what it is. Whoa! Oh gosh! No! Gosh! Oh. Oh wow. That hurt so very bad. I should have summoned. Okay, um, I will know better next time. I do want to do Tears of the Savior. I, I, I want to do it. I have to do it. Uh, let's come at it from a different angle, shall we? Okay, Namira Shrine. Yes, those cats are still flippin' dangerous. You have no idea. Obscuro's Oblivion Overhaul makes those cats incredibly dangerous. And speaking of which, who is... Summon. Okay, it's just a Mystic Gimp. I was freaking out. I thought it was another cat. Go get him, Stanky! Did it just kill? It just killed Stanky. How dare you? Stupid mystical imp. Gotta be on the lookout for that kitty. Where is the enemy? Okay. What music do I listen to? Actually, quite a lot. <laughs> I listen to a crap ton of music. Um, the ones I usually don't listen to is uh, usually rap. I don't really like rap as much. Um, there are a couple exceptions. 
Uh, I don't really like Ska or anything where it's just like absolute screaming in your ear. And then of course, um, what was the other thing? I don't like horrorcore or anything like that. And I don't like, I like country, but I don't like country with the huge twang to it. That's kind of eh. But outside of those exceptions, I'm pretty much open to anything. I do like some rage. Some rage metal is awesome. Especially if I'm in a mood. Oh no. Oh, it's just a wolf. There's another wolf. Where are you? Oh, oh gosh, I thought that was a kitty. I was like, no! I was like, I do not like kitties in this game. 24-7. Oblivion. Nothing else. Oh, look. That that wolf's running. Look at that wolf run. more soul gems. Okay, now that I've killed all the fauna in the area, I still gotta get to Frostfire Glade. <clears throat> and avoid that kitty. I am, wow, whoa, my FPS just went down. What is going on? I totally missed it, didn't I? Okay. I have found it, but I have not actually found it. Please tell me that wasn't the kitty. No, it's just another wolf. That keeps avoiding my hits. Really? Oh my goodness. No, my computer didn't crash. Sometimes it does that. I don't even know why. Frostfire Cave. Yes! We're going to find these Tears of the Savior. Maybe. <laughs> we might find them. Stop dodging. Thank you. <laughs> Stop dodging, start dying. <clears throat> oh my goodness. It seems like the flame is a lot better on Tundra Wolves. It's super happy fun time. Starting to make no sense, Linkness. Been drinking lately? <laughs> Ooh, there's two wolves. Three wolves. Four wolves. This calls for Stanky. This calls for Skelly Jelly. 
This calls for my faded wrath that I have no name for. It's a pack of wolves. It's a whole family. Ooh, nice, Stanky. Good job. Good job, Stanky. Sometimes wolf fight in caves to to uh, hang out in, you know. That was awesome. My minions worked. <clears throat> this should work. don't remember this place at all. Welcome back, by the way. Probably had to get something to drink or whatnot. I have no idea what you're saying. <laughs> Just thought I should let you know. Oh, ow. Ooh. Oh, this hurts me. Oh, I'm being hurt. Very badly. Lord. So now I gotta find some tears, huh? Where the heck are these tears? Okay, uh, sure. Oh my gosh, they're all over the place. Oh, this is lovely. We're gonna be oh lord, lordy lord! I have to find five of them in here? Are you kidding me? Ah, this sucks. Three more to go. Two more to go. I need potions. <clears throat> oh my goodness. It's redonkulous. Uh, no, it's just the one Frost Atronach. He was the only guy here. And I can't see crap. <laughs> I can't see anything. If there's more tears, I wouldn't know it. Okay, I think I just made a big circle now. Uh, let's see here. Okay, is there anything up here? Yes, there is. There's one up here. Is there any more next to him? <clears throat> oh, more people in the channel? Uh, sometimes, very rarely, <laughs> but sometimes. There's usually about two to three people in every stream. Um, but I usually don't have too many people in the chat, but that's okay, because we usually get more in-depth in our conversations than I would normally get. There are like 15 people talking all at once, you know? Uh, well, my goodness. Where the heck is that last uh, tier? If you see the tier anywhere, let me know. And to answer your earlier question, I'll answer both of your questions. You said, how long have I been streaming? Uh, I've been streaming since the end of February, actually. Um, <clears throat> once a week for every week since February. 
Uh, but for tonight, I've been streaming since 9 o'clock. The times I usually stream when I do stream are between 9 and midnight Eastern Standard Time. Ow. Okay, I don't know where this last tier is. I really don't. And my FPS is dead. It's like 6 frames per second. Oh, feel free to check out the YouTube. Seriously, feel free. There's tons of content there, and more coming too. Gosh, this is annoying. I am wasting, literally wasting energy trying to find this stupid tier. And I have no clue where it is. I know what I'm looking for now, but I can't see it. And my stream just died in frame rate. And now it's going up. I guess it's just that area. Okay, we will come back for the Frostfire Glade tiers. Because I don't know where any where the rest of them are. Of course not. 